20 years ago in Occidental Mindoro, you could catch yellowfin tuna 60 kilometers from shore in just a few hours. Today, fishers travel over 200 kilometers for 5 to 12 days and could still come home without a single tuna. Tuna is the Philippines' top seafood export commodity. Yellowfin tuna fishing is a way of life for the coastal communities of Occidental Mindoro. Over a thousand fishing vessels benefit from the abundance of Mindoro Strait. However, climate change has been warming our seas, forcing tuna to travel further from shore in search of cooler waters. As tuna fishers try to catch up, they risk their lives against bigger, stronger waves. They spend and borrow more money to prepare for each trip. Warmer waters also mean lower quality tuna, which sells at lower prices. For the tuna fishers of Mindoro, however, simply bringing home a tuna is considered a success. As one tuna fisher put it, Kung sanda ang pangka kayo sa laon, mga 30 lang dyan ang makakahuli ng tuna. WWF Philippines has worked with Occidental Mindoro's tuna fishers since 2011 to adapt to climate change by improving government representation, establishing financial support within the community, and teaching sustainable fishing practices. Two projects, the Sustainable Tuna Partnership 2 and Project Buhay, Tuna Habang Buhay, Dagdag Hanap Buhay, are working together to further build the resilience of tuna fishing communities against climate change impacts. Project Buhay helps tuna fishers improve the quality of caught tuna and earn more from their catch. The project is also exploring alternative livelihoods to supplement income and fund tuna fishing trips. Helping tuna fishers earn more and broaden their income streams would empower them to continue their sustainable fishing practices. Adapting to climate change is essential to mitigate it. In truth, it could take generations to feel the effects of climate action. As we work to protect the planet for future generations, we continue to look for ways to help our communities survive through the current climate crisis.